What most people understand is that the best way to avoid a no-deal outcome, the best way to avoid a disorderly Brexit of any kind, is to make the preparations now that will enable us to leave in a managed way if we have to. But above all, if we make the preparations now, we will carry the conviction with our friends and partners that we are indeed able to make such an exit if we really have to. You brought shame on your party when you described veiled Muslim women as letterboxes and bank robbers. People who have worked closely with you do not think you're fit to be Prime Minister. I'm delighted that um, many of my former colleagues uh, seem to dissent from, from, from that view. But, but one of the reasons why the public feels alienated now from us all as a, as a, as a breed it's because too often they feel we are muffling and veiling our language, if I might put it that way. You told GQ uh, some years ago now when asked whether you'd taken cocaine. Yes, I tried it at university. Well, I think the canonical account of this uh, event when I was 19 has appeared many, many times. And I think what most people in this country uh, really want us to focus on in this campaign, if I may say so, uh, is what we can do for them.